When I'm thinking of buying new things, I always end up doing two different things. Looking at people's reviews on the site I'm buying from and YouTubing it and searching for reviews about it. And most of the time, that works out great. But sometimes I want the juicy details, but there isn't anything like that, even after looking through 10 different reviews of the same product on YouTube. So what if I want to see how hot my laptop gets in this very specific corner or this one? Some reviews actually get that detailed, even if that topic is really, really boring. So today we're gonna talk about some great places to look for amazing reviews on the internet and on YouTube. Let's get started. Why did I write down YouTube and internet on this script as if YouTube isn't on the internet? Whatever. When I'm looking for detailed reviews, there are a couple of things I'm looking for. Number one, how crazily detailed the reviews are. Number two, is there some sort of metric to measure how good a product is? Number three, did my opinion change in a positive or negative way towards the product? The first great example, the one I wanna start off with is notebookcheck.net. Each review they do, they provide a score that gives you a general idea of how good a given laptop is for its category. You wouldn't be seeing an Alienware laptop compared to a MacBook on these charts because those machines are built for completely different things. Like how you would never compare a Volkswagen Beetle to a Ferrari. Instead, they base their numbered rating on how well a laptop does within its own category. And because I like seeing a ranking system, this stuff helps me make a better purchasing decision. Also, their reviews are so, so detailed. It gets down to how hot each section of a laptop is under heavy load. They graph the audio quality of the speakers, and they also take a look at backlight bleed of laptop displays. The best part is if a particular detail of a laptop doesn't matter to you, you can just scroll on. You can just skip it. You can move on to the next part. Wow. They also occasionally review laptops in different languages as well, making it a great international resource for laptop reviews, especially if you perhaps don't speak English. But if you don't, how are you watching this video? If you're considering buying a laptop, the very first place I check for a detailed analysis definitely is notebookcheck.net. Now that's not to say YouTube reviews are bad. They can be a great resource to get an idea of how a product looks, feels, and how large they are while also providing valuable insight. My favorite YouTubers, at least for laptops, are Dave2D and Mobile Tech Review. Here's something I've gotten into for the last year or two, travel gear. For my full-time job, I ended up traveling quite a bit. And I say traveled because, <laughs> you know. But I couldn't find too many YouTube videos that went into depth enough about backpacks or general travel gear. That is until I found packhacker.com, a review site similar to notebookcheck.net, but instead of looking at laptops, they look at travel gear and provide in-depth reviews of products, fills you in on how the item has held up over time, and it has me spending way too much money on travel gear that I have never heard of, but end up really loving. And usually you don't see this on the screen, but sometimes in the corner over here, there might be some boxes. That's all the stuff I end up buying for this channel or places from Packhacker. Uh, you know, since the stay at home order, I've been buying a lot and the boxes, they just, they just keep piling up. I hate it. I can make a cardboard fort at this point. Anyway, back on topic, they also have a YouTube channel that provides similar reviews, but in a video format. Overall, I felt their site was a bit more detailed, but both their site and YouTube channel are absolutely fantastic. If you're more into YouTube, there's a channel, Chase Reeves, focused primarily on backpacks and his 40 minute long videos gives you a great deep dive. But if you want reviews on primarily travel gear in general, Pack Hacker is absolutely fantastic. The next one is Artings. Ratings? Our ting thing? Originally, they reviewed only TVs and provided valuable in-depth information with, you guessed it, a rating system. But over time, they added new categories like headphones, monitors, keyboards, mice, and well, even printers. You know, I, I really can't wait to find one that prints my face in 5% clearer detail because that's absolutely necessary. Joking aside, they are just as detailed as the sites I mentioned earlier and their rating system breaks it down to the type of content you watch on a TV as well. They do similar breakdowns for all the other types of products they review as well as recommend better products for the potential price point of the product you're looking at. They do have a YouTube channel as well, but I felt that their site had more detailed reviews and contained more content in general. I 
I don't really watch any YouTubers that I could see as a replacement for rtings.com because they're really unique. Lastly, when I was searching for cameras to upgrade to for my YouTube channel, I found myself with many options and being very, very confused. I did end up with a Sony Alpha A7 III and I absolutely love this thing. I'm recording off of it right now. You can see everything probably too much because I didn't shave today. But I fell in love with that camera after seeing so many different reviews and doing so much research. One of the sites that was so helpful during all this was dpreview.com because, well, you can see the trend forming here. They have a numbered review system and a ton of detailed reviews. I left DP Review last on this list because I felt most people would get bored by this part of the video and click off already. And because I felt like DP Review was already a well-established site for camera geeks. They also have great YouTube format reviews as well, but if you wanna see a channel with amazing in-depth reviews and research on cameras and camera gear, Gerald Undone does a fantastic job of going into way too much detail. His channel is honestly amazing to watch. I can watch that guy forever. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it wasn't too boring for you and I hope you found new places to look when you're searching for reviews of your next big tech or <laughs> travel gear purchase. Now, let me ask you this hard hitting question. Where do you go to find great reviews? Is it a site? a YouTube channel, or you just look at how many stars it has on Amazon. Leave all that in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And well, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.